Yo guys, what is going on? Welcome back to a brand new episode of WWE Supercard. This is episode 164. So I'm actually doing this quite short after, shortly after I did the first, but the last episode. Um, but there's a lot we need to talk about, and that is a potential new update to Supercard coming very soon, in my opinion. Now. This, this video is me going explaining a couple of things, showing you guys what I think is going to be a new update coming very soon, a couple of arguments, and those kind of things. Let me know down in the comments what you guys think. I'm, in no means am I saying guaranteed update coming, but most likely there is. So, a couple of things we're going to talk about. Um, it's getting very loud outside. Um, I live kind of like in, you know, in Switzerland, lots of cows, lots of you know, just farmers and stuff, and they, they're, they're, they're walking their cows, basically. Yep, they're literally walking their cows. So it's very noisy. Anyway, um, what was I even talking about? The new update. So the main thing I want to talk to you guys about is, in ultimate tier, it's getting louder and louder. Seriously, can you... It's getting louder and louder. God damn farmers. All right, well... See, like, still getting louder and louder. They're literally, like, walking outside my house right now. Give me like two secs guys, I'll be right back. Alright guys, and I'm back. Less noise outside now. So, uh, let's get straight into talking about what I wanted to talk about now. This isn't like, going to confirm it to you guys, but in Ultimate Tier there were nine event cards. Um, we had one female and then eight just superstars. In WrestleMania Tier, we've had only eight with this Samoa Joe and then one female which was the Bailey. So, about the same amount of cards, they've done the female and the tier, um, you know, they've given out really good cards in the under tier, and that's what I'm going to talk to you guys about now. Um, we had Ty Dillinger, which was the first card they put in repeats, um, which gave a pro to a lot of people. They've been giving out really good cards recently, uh, lots of like Undertaker, uh, Goldberg, like, good, really good cards, and now, in this ring domination, the undercard, I'm going to spoil for everyone, guys, if you do not want to know, mute this part, but yeah, the undercard is Seth Rollins, which is, again, another really top tier, um, like, top, 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 uh, like, top five, I think, so that's, and that's a pro for me, which is great, and it's a really another good card, that's, like, three really, really good pros, um, with Goldberg, Undertaker, and AJ Styles as well, and now Seth, so four, in, like, the last five days and at this stage a lot of people getting all their decks very high look like I've got like a full Wrestlemania deck bar two uh, ultimate females there but I'm gonna get Carmella hopefully pro really soon and it shouldn't be too long before we get another one and yeah that is it we're done on that and it just seems to me like we are gonna get a new tier very soon the game went down for like six hours for maintenance or did they bring something extra or was it just them messing up when it was only meant to be about 30 minutes I don't know maybe they were maybe they're bringing a new tier in doing something at least a lot of people in a new tier or something new at least it's been a while now since we've had background which is new it's been fun but it's soon gonna get um, just as you know kind of mm, I'm not gonna say boring but just like the other events, it's gonna not people are gonna play a little bit less at least. So yeah, that's why I think there's gonna be a new tier coming out soon. Let me know again, guys, what you think in the comments. But let's get straight into some ring domination, which is Seth Rollins. The ultimate was Bray Wyatt. Um, so I've already got like I already had like three or four times I've already proed him. So yeah, not 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 catalog or anything. Seth Rollins is a pro again. Really happy about that. And then Samoa Joe. The so Samojo is the ninth event, sorry, the eighth event card. So yeah, I'm really happy it's Samojo. Really happy, like I really like the wrestler. Uh, it's left arrow as well, which could be better. It could have been a down arrow. Um, yeah, it could have been better. Arrow could have been better, but I'm not complaining. I'm happy with Samojo. Uh, let's go with. Yeah, we don't need to target that brawn. It's not like we're going to get a clean victory here. Well, perfect sweep, 9-0. So we'll just try and make it as quick as possible. Right, that's a good win. So my shot luck has been okay. I'm not say it's been amazing. Bray Wyatt it took a bit of time. Uh, yeah, but, you know, I just sat down and watched some old um, wrestling Raw Smackdown from 2000, which is actually what I've been doing quite recently as the internet's been down quite a lot. 
I've had a lot of spare time on my hands when I'm not working, obviously. So I've just been going back watching uh, episodes of Raw, episodes of SmackDown from that I started literally when I was born. I started like beginning of January 2000. That's the first episode of Raw, I think I wasn't born yet, and then I was. So I started literally, I just wanted to start watching everything I've missed since I've been on this earth. And it's going to take a long time if I want to catch up because I've got a good nine, ten years of Raw and SmackDowns to watch from like about 2010, 2009, I would say. Um, so yeah, plus the pay per views. <laughs> it might just take me like 20 years to do it, but it's, it's fun, at least I'm enjoying it. It's definitely really different from wrestling nowadays so it is, it is quite fun anyway let's get uh let's get well let's watch a, let's watch an ad 25 seconds yeah we can watch a 25 second ad so i've just finished uploading episode 163 it's literally just gone up i uh, hope you guys by then have watched the video and you've enjoyed it um quite quite a good one actually we got to open a pack i did hopefully like, it's not, but I don't know your reaction to it yet and what I've titled it. I've titled it Two Platinum Packs. Um, I can see a lot of people, like, thinking that is clickbaiting because I only opened one pack in the video because I accidentally opened the, like, the second pack just before, what, well, the night before of the video. And, well, I'll show you how I get It's a pretty good pack. So I hope, hope not, not so many of you guys are upset by that. But pretty cool. Definitely pretty cool. And obviously now you guys know it is the Carmella. Um, which, <laughs> great rewards. Why every time I do it off camera I get good rewards? Well, no, that's not true. I did get that James Ellsworth, which was pretty sh shit. Pretty shit. So, let's get Jinder in the middle over there. We might just pro Jinder and, um, Jinder and Undertaker in this video. Maybe. Maybe I'll come back at the, you know, I'm pretty sure they're almost done anyway. So, we'll finish off this game. We'll look if we can pro them. If we can, we will. If not, we'll end the video there. Um, so, okay, I've tinned her actually, oh no, I targeted, okay, never mind. and do we have a down arrow? We don't have a down arrow, unfortunately, so we won't be able to get another game on the Jinder. But we can go with that Goldberg, or we could go, yeah, Taker can't win anything, so we're not gonna, we're not gonna mess that up and not win this game. Goldberg is so good, he gets me so many wins, like, he gets wins against event cards, it's really, really good, really, really good. He got a couple wins against Jeff. Um, well, obviously, if he procs and it calls like power or charisma, Jeff is a bit screwed. Especially if Brock, if uh, Goldberg procs like twice, <laughs> which happened a couple times. Like I have gotten quite lucky actually. I have to say, definitely got quite lucky. And we're gonna lose this game, aren't we? The second I say we've been getting lucky, we lose the game. All right, it's a shame. Let's even get a shard though. Hopefully, we can. That would make it. That'd make it up to you guys. Give me a shot. Give me, give me like, give me Seth, Seth, Seth's face. That'd be pretty cool. Remember, like the first Seth I got was a long, long time ago when we first did that pack opening when WrestleMania tier came out. Um, like my most viewed video to this day ever that I've ever uploaded on YouTube. So that awesome that I'm gonna get a pro of that Seth. It's definitely gonna be an awesome, awesome memory that that WrestleMania Seth Rollins. Because he was the thumbnail of that video as well, which made it really awesome. Okay, so we're going to watch another ad. Um, I don't know why I clicked on it. I'm sorry, guys. I hate doing this while I'm in a video. But I've just, I've, you know, it's been a couple of months now that I said it's just going to stop spending a lot of money on this game when I don't have to, you know. Um, for bouts, you know, bouts is the main, main thing that, uh, that I'll say, you know. So, yeah. Anyway, let's uh, let's go and see how Jinder is doing, if he's all done or not. I'm pretty sure he might have, like, a couple games left. Maybe in speed and charisma. Maybe. No, he's done. Brilliant. Okay, so we can pro him. Can we pro Taker as well? Or is it Taker who needs a couple games? Yeah, it is. It is. Okay, so Taker isn't completely done yet. So, we'll pro him in the next episode. But we can pro Jinder Hall. As you guys know, in the last episode, I misplaced one of its tokens, which I am upset about. Maybe some of you guys will say, oh, I could have contacted uh, Cat Daddy and they could have helped me out with that. But ultimately, I'm not going to go through the fuss of that. If it matters, it matters. If it does, you know, I, I think I think it won't change too much uh, in, the, in the long run. So there we go. He is level 50. All of his games are played. All of his tokens are used. That one is the right gender, the one that I should have. 
I should have done this one like the other one, but no, instead of putting three in toughness, I only put two, and I also put two in speed. So, a bit of a shame there, a bit stupid, but we'll move on, and that ginger is all done. So let's go and pro him, guys. Obviously, event card, last event card, uh, took a little bit of time, but we finally got there. Let's go and pro him. There is Jinder Pro, your WWE champion as well, Jinder Mahal. Um, so yeah, that is it, guys. Little sneak peek of what we got left to pro. Um, Undertaker, Dean Ambrose, Carmella. So it's going to be exciting. We're going to start King of the Ring as well in just a bit. Um, I'll do that later. But yeah, thank you guys so much for watching this episode. If you guys have enjoyed it, don't forget to drop a like on this episode. And I'll see you guys tomorrow for a brand new episode. Until then, take care. Most importantly, peace. Out.